Have you ever said in the wintertime you would like to look like a crappie viking? Well, have no fear. Your boy D. Crappie has you. I'm going to take care of that. All new for 2021, the crappie head chinchilla hat. For you. You might say, hey, D. Crappie, that just looks like a faux chinchilla hat. But you know what? They might not see you coming, but they'll see you going. When they see that crappie head signature badge on the back, they'll know you have an official crappie head chinchilla. Mm. Crappiehead.com gets you some. Pew! But wait! That's not it. Check out this lovely blue one Bondo is sporting. So make sure you get your crappie head chinchilla hat while they last. Also, you have a little covering for when you're going across the water. That wind keeps it out your face. You can snap it at the bottom, make it action extra snugly. Hey, crappiehead.com. Let me fix my chinchilla right. Get you some! What's up, family? <laughs> me and your boy Bundo. Bundo. On that water, on that water, y'all. I got a word from my buddy that it was popping over at this spot we at. Guys, I got surprised. Man, I got that chinchilla. You know how you got the little hair that you just can't get? There you go, I got him. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Guess what I'm in, y'all? The kayak! <laughs> yeah, baby! Hey, I wanna give a big shout out to Sterling Hinton. My man, get with me, dcroppy at gmail.com. Send you some baits. He came up with the name for the new big boat, Slab Sled. He was the first person to say it. I know some other people said it, but he was the first person to say it. Slab Sled, that is very fitting. But guys, we had, we, we're at some deliciousness. Got the Bondo Mobile. Bundle Mobile, you, get, you, got, you got excited about when I said that Bundle Mobile. Got to get another name for it. The Bundle Mobile fitting, huh? Okay, I mean, what you what you want? What you thinking? You want the girls people? is a Cadillac. Mine a Cadillac. Bundleville. Bundleville. <laughs> Bundleville. <laughs> yeah, Cadillac might try to get a hold to you for doing that. Girls is a oh. is the Cadillac. <laughs> Well, I mean, uh, me and Caddy, me and Caddy, got a relationship of a uh, big, deep-rooted history. I got a lot of family members Cadillac broke down. So. <laughs> <laughs> so, family, I think I got some slab smashing action for y'all coming. I stayed up all night last night rigging this up. I wanted to have me some eyes. I want to thank my boy, Sergeant Slab for blessing me with that HDS9. Make sure y'all go check out Slab Chasing TV. Sergeant Slab started him a channel, guys. Go support that for me, please. Hit that subscribe button. But uh, let's push these things off in the water and we're gonna show y'all what we finna do. I think I should've got it closer to the water. Ah. Oh, shucky ducky. Oh, man. Oh, 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 oh. oh, man, it feels so good to be back in the Cadillac. It feels so good. I see we can push off. And we can. Okay, we rolling. Wow. All right, all right, we're pushing off. Time to go catch some fish. Man, I should run some tissue, boy. I'm gonna be snotty McKirkland right there, boy. This feels so good. This feels so good. I see some fish on the drop off. We going to go fish this bridge, y'all. All right, this bridge is usually just loaded beyond belief a lot of times. All right, let's go by this column, guys. It's the first time scanning on the cat with the Cadillac. Let's see if I can get that. Y'all can get a little view of this. It's piled up. Bundo said it's piled up, y'all. Let me see if I can get y'all a shot of it. Oh, there got some bait fish. Well, big fish. 
Well, you know what? We finna scratch at it. We finna, we finna scratch at it, y'all. We finna scratch at it. You know what? I'm fishing with a five foot B&M sharpshooter. Let's see what it can do for us. Now, I don't know how well this trolling motor is gonna work close to this bridge. Good night almighty, they piled up under there. Let's try it out. All right, so that's five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And we gonna swing him over there. We gonna swing him over there. We gonna swing him over there. It's first one, y'all. First swing. I'm excited. So excited. Uh oh, something tapped it. Come up a little bit higher. Come about nine foot. Mm, there we go. Off the bat, guys. Off the bat. Off the bat. Got us a banger. Got us a banger. Ooh, we got a little piggy pie. Look at this piggy pie. Come here. Piggy pie. Look at this piggy pie. <laughs> Man. Look at that, y'all. Look at that. Look at that doozy. Good night, almighty. First drop, first one. Got us a doozy. We got us a bucket for this stuff. We got a bucket for this. We got a bucket for this, y'all. Say, man, I'm trying to film uh, rudeness. Gosh, boy, Bundo so rude. Y'all heard him talking all in the side, side of my neck while I'm trying to, trying to talk to y'all and, and present this fish for y'all. Goodness, y'all, look at that thing. Mm. Oh. Put the lid on there. Woo. Mm. All right, guys, so I'm using a double jig setup, two hand ties, an orange one on the bottom, black one with a blue head. I got them roughly a foot and um, almost a foot and a half apart, probably about 13. 13 inches apart and what I'm doing I saw him sitting there sitting around nine foot the, the total depth of this water is 10 so I threw it past where they were and let it swing swung swing back into them I can't talk I'm so stirred up guys I'm gonna do it again so I measure off my dip all right that's five because I know the rod's five six seven eight nine don't you do it don't you do it trauma don't you bump that throw I scared them fish. Alright, so I'm swinging it back over there. Oh, it, it bumped it. It bumped it. I'm gonna unspot like it. Hopefully, it didn't scare them all off. Because I saw them sitting all around the collar. And what I'm gonna do is just walk, walk the jig around it. And make it. Mm, there you go, baby. There you go. There it go. Mm. Mm. Man, this being the M5 foot sharpshooter. That's a strong rod. For the for as little as it is, it's a strong rod. Mm. Thank you. Get that fish up for y'all. Mm. Man, I got too many clothes on the move. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to start taking off some of these jokers. I can't even move. Come on, fish, work with me. All right, got a nice old keeper right here. It ain't as big as that last doozy, but it's still a long, pretty black, black crappie. One that's going to, oh man, you know what? That noise that, that I was hearing earlier was Bondo trying to get credit for, you know, me finding that fish. He wanted to take credit of it for it, but I wasn't giving it to him. And now he has decided to claim jump. He can't take seeing me catch too many fish without coming. Man, this Old Town kayak is awesome. Autopilot 120, guys. I, I suggest you go take a look at one or any of uh, Old Town's kayak lineups. Look at that. Old Bondo struck blood over there. What you, oh, man, doubled up. I can't even show y'all heels because I got mines. Mm. Oh, that's another good one. Gosh. Is that a crappie? Oh my goodness, I gotta get the net. 
I gotta get the neck. That's a good one. That's a good one. Mm. My goodness. My goodness. That's a white crappie too. I thought that joke was a bass. You can't see claim jumper. That ain't gonna do nothing but it, it ignite your claim jumper-ish. This. Y'all can't okay, see him, he's too far away. I would say you gotta come over here so I can see it, but I don't want you claim jumping. Look at her. Say. <laughs> yes, sir. All right, all right, we're gonna do it again, y'all. Plan ain't changed. Stuff still remains the same. So, five, six, seven. Eight. This time we're gonna throw it on this side. Man, man, man. Boy, they are blessing my life, y'all. I'm, I'm trying to tell you these fish blessing my life. Cause that, that thump is a Oh, that was one right there. That was one right there. This little rod has a like, to me, a late registry. It doesn't register just instantly. Even with that braid, it's got like a delayed effect to it. But I'm still able to, you know, pretty much capitalize on the bite because they getting it, you know. And the thing about it is they're not really getting it all the way because all the fish, are, they have it right at the front of their mouth. But that little hand tie, they can't resist it. Ooh, gosh. That joke hit it hard, boy. Goodness, he hit it hard. So I'm gonna do exactly what I did earlier with uh, going around the column. And see if we can get us an eagle beaver. Come and bless us. Another doozy. Mm, there you go. There you go, walked it around that column. And he walked into that jig. Boy, these fat little, fat little fish. Mm, 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 mm. Goodness. Ooh, got a piece of that hook. These hooks sharp too. I'm gonna spot lock it while I take care of this fish. Oh no. The jig fell all the way through his gills. Let's see if I can pull it out. Nice and easy. Always give yourself some slack guys to work and get that hook out of there. Cause if you have your rod bent over, you'll have a tension just pushing back on your on your jig, actually working against you. With that slack line, it gives you it gives you the capability of working that fish and getting them out of there. I mean, these are some very good quality fish, man. Very good quality fish. Every last one of them. Hey guys, another thing, moonshinecrappiejigs.com is open. The website is open. You can go and order the crappie head signature box there and all the other jigs that, that you might like. Go check it out moonshinecrappiejigs.com guys I had to freeze this look at all those fish right there they're stacked away from the column I, I wonder did I did I scare them away when I came through there bumping that column I know where they're at we finna go chunk at them alright so this is this might be a lot of fun right here cause I saw them sitting away from the column so I can actually just post up right over here and they were sitting in a different depth from the bottom all the way up and uh what i'm gonna do is just slowly retrieve it through them and see if they'll pop it and i'll more or less let the jig just fall through the water and just re pick up the slack Ooh, there you go there you go Bundo putting on, putting on, putting on the show over there. Ah, oh, yeah, another good fish. Another good fish. Man, there's so many of them. I just bumped through them. <clears throat> Woo! <laughs> he got you doing that quickie pull, huh? Mm, there you go. Yep. A little bit of thing. Oh, hold on. 
Oh, he got he got tarpon in his blood, boy. That fish had tarpon. You know what? I ain't got no cropping measure with me. I know that's by 10, but I ain't gonna take no chance. That little shooby doo. Boy, boy, boy. When I tell y'all family, I am having me a time and it ain't even, the day ain't even got nowhere. It's still early. I am still having me a time. I, I can probably vouch for Bundo too that he having him a time. You having a time, <laughs> Bundo? Thump is real, man. Thump is real. All right, go. Come up with it. Come up with it, little baby. Little baby. Whoa. I think he ate both of my jigs, man. How you get a fish to eat both of your jigs at one time? Gosh, Lee. This should be it right here. I'm, I'm anticipating a hit. Hopefully not by us running into each other. Say, man, you just broke my prop. God. You gotta learn how to drive your little bucket. Come up with it. Mm. Boy. Oh, that's a good fish. That's a good old, good old fish, good old quality keeper right there. Somebody's on jig. Oh, you you to repo some jigs? Yeah. <laughs> Got a jig repo over here. Mm. All right, guys, we found us some more. We found us some underwater stuff over here. And uh, I made the mistake of dropping without recording. And I caught I caught a nice old fish. I, I, I didn't want to tell y'all. But I'm going to try to do it. I'm going to try to make up for it right here. I am so glad I installed this graph, man, because I was tired of going out and uh, not not being able to see the things I need to fish, uh, see the things I needed to see to fish like I want to fish. So I am so happy. It is so rewarding when you find something and you actually catch fish off of it, and you you know you identify the species that you're targeting. And watch that, watch that pole. Gosh, I told you, boy. I'm you gotta fix, back. you gotta fix that. Y'all see what I gotta deal with on the water family? This is what I deal with at a bundo. He is the most wanted claim jumper of the year. He's the MVP claim jumper. I wanna catch one for y'all because of uh, the one I caught off camera. I wanna make up that that fish oh yeah baby yeah baby pole bender this for you champ a pole bender oh man oh man oh my goodness oh my goodness oh my goodness oh my goodness. oh come on 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 now now Oh, 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 my goodness. Look at that thing. I saw him. I saw, <laughs> I told y'all. That's why I was sticking around out here. Cause I saw these things sitting down there. I saw. <laughs> That's a doozy right there, baby. That's a doozy deluxe. Man. I'm finna get back down there. I'm finna get back there. There's some more down there. Yeah, there's some more. There's some more down there. Come on, baby. The boat is in the right position. Come on, come on. There it go. There it go. Come on, come on. Come on. Dang it. Oh, there it go. There it go. There it go. That ain't big as that other one. That's a little fish. Little fish. Gosh. Woo! Did y'all see that last thing? 
Come on, baby. Go on, baby. Let me get back down there. Get out the way of the biggins. Come on, baby. Come on. You know, this is the part. This is this is what I like, man. You know, I don't have live scope out here giving me everything. I'm I'm having to work for this, you know. That's that's the way I like to do it, man. Like I said, and I'm in like, you know, I'm not talking about people with live scope at all. I get more reward out of a fishing trip when I'm out fishing like this. Oh my goodness, my goodness, he, I mean, he knocked the smoke off it. Oh yeah, he knocked the smoke off that thing. Oh, he splashed me right in the eye. Ah. Man, I don't even know. I know he knocked the smoke off that thing. I thought that uh, little hand tie was done for but he changed, he changed that, he changed that up. Whoo! All right, there got my motor back going, y'all. It got my motor back going. He put some smoke on that thing, boy. Yeah, we gonna try to repeat that. Mm, yes, sir, he did it. Yes, sir, he did it. Just like that oven. Mm. Woo! Come here, come here. Cut it out. Cut it out. It's, the deal is done, buddy. Deal is done. Look at that thing. <laughs> Somebody gonna get fed around here. Somebody gonna get fed around here. Anybody hungry? Anybody hungry? Let's do it again, y'all. Let's do it again. Come on, Bundo. Pull up with it. Pull up with it, Bundo. That thumb feel good? Yeah, buddy. There you go. When they smoke it, they smoking it. My little rod coming apart. That look, that's a little cupcake right there. That's, that's first thin to tender we didn't caught. I think you promoted that bun though. I think you brung that on. That little, that little thin to tender bite. <laughs> I think you brung that on, bro. Cause I ain't saw a thin to tender until you just caught one. I promise it's probably about two, three hundred crappie right down there. Mm, my goodness, my goodness! Ooh. Mm. Man. Wish y'all could see Bundo little face. He, he almost. What you say? Say it again. He almost took your rod. The fish almost took your rod. Boy, Bundo been hanging with the champ too much. That's that. That's that champ type lingo. I'm gonna take my rod. There you go. There you go. Come on up with it. Come on up with it. Uh-oh. Let's spot like this thing. Ooh, man. Look at that. Cutie. That thing right there look like a delicatessen. Oh, man. Look at that thing, y'all. Goodness, that's a cutie. That is a cutie. Bundo, how did, how did it make how did how, What did it do for your life? Uh, it changed the narrative of my whole life right here. That did? Yeah, this, this made me bun delicious. <laughs> <laughs> that clown said it made him bun delicious. Oh, man. Hey, family, I just want to say, man, I appreciate y'all watching. I appreciate all the support y'all give. I love the comments. I mean, y'all just wonderful, man. And uh, please be respectful. That last video with, at uh, Russ Private Lake, please, people, do not call Russ Aston. Can you come fish this lake? It is private for a reason, you know. Um, but I just, I just thank y'all for all the support. Um, keep watching. I'll keep posting. As always, I see y'all on the water next time. Peace. I'm out. Woo! 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 Woo!